Hello, fine people of this beautiful planet Earth. Today is Monday, April 6th, 2015. And what a glorious Monday it has been. Had a small case of the Mondays. Um, just had a hard time getting up and getting going with my day. But eventually I was like, you know, I gotta just do something. So <clears throat> I jumped in the pool and... did my physical therapy exercises for a while and actually like a really hard hard workout so that felt good um not too sore which is good if I were to do that kind of stuff outside of the water I'd be totally dead so the water's amazing um then I came back and took a nice Epsom bath and cooked I ended up doing the black bean veggie patty burger thing again to see if I could work on the ingredients and figure that out. Um, <laughs> it was really good again, but I didn't really measure. I guess I have a problem with that. I'm wearing my Dysautonomia Awareness t-shirt from www.dinet.org, D-I-N-E-T dot O-R-G. Um, it's one of the first very helpful websites I came across when I was first diagnosed with um, a couple different forms of dysautonomia. I was first diagnosed with neurocardiogenic syncope and then um, later found out uh, that I had postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome, which is, you know, commonly known as POTS. So dinet.org is a great little resource for a lot of information if you're just starting out on that route, um, check it out. This shirt's a bunch of years old, but still works. <laughs> um, what else today? Been hurting. Knees are hurting pretty bad. I think worse than yesterday. Ankles are just a little less than bad. Um, I mean, they're still bad, but they're not as bad as the knees, I guess. Um, I've had, like, this pinched nerve in my neck for a few days now, and I think it's getting better, so that's wonderful. Um, how was your Monday? Um, I'd like to say that I'm going to go to bed because it's almost 1030, but realistically I probably won't be able to fall asleep until like 2 or 3, so that's fun. I don't know. Plans for tomorrow. Um, I really need to find a dentist. I'm freaking out because... I have very minimal dental insurance and I need to see a biological dentist who is familiar with um, Lyme disease and who's familiar with the uh, horrific problems associated with amalgam and mercury fillings because I have um, one root canal with a, an amalgam <coughs> filling and it's coincidental or not that a lot of my issues got a lot worse um, when I had that root canal done when I was 12. So, um, yeah, I am, from my research, I know it's, it's crucial to get it removed and fixed and probably going to end up just having to have the tooth pulled, which is terrifying because I like to keep as many body parts as possible. Um... Yep, so it's not going to be a fun journey, but it's part of it, and certainly not going to be cheap, but yep, we'll get to that when it happens. So, um, anybody have experience with that kind of stuff? Um, love to hear how it went, and if it helped getting the amalgams removed, or root canal extracted, or, um, 
any of that, but I'm sure I'll be talking more about that in the next future life of my journey. And, um, yep. Be kind and don't forget to rewind. Ugh. I hate that I can't think. Like, I'd really love to be able to form a complete thought and have it make sense and be a real conversation. I don't mean a conversation like with a camera, but a real conversation with a person because half the time I'm sitting there like, eh, like I'm hearing you, but I'm not processing and I'm not communicating. <laughs> so yeah, no, it's, I mean, like I know it'll get better, but it just sucks feeling like, I don't know. Have a bit of the Mondays. How was your Monday? Hopefully less than the Monday blues and oh my god, what am I talking about? I don't even know. I hope you had a good Monday. How about that? That sounds like coherent words in a sentence. And yes. I wrote up a little um um note of what I was gonna talk about on this this video, and so far this is all I have says um i don't know if you can see it probably not um it's just the date so that's that's i got it it's good a plus for effort right 